Did you know your body makes a vitamin you can hardly use? It's true, we produce vitamin B12 deep in our gut, but we can't absorb it there. It's a total biological plot twist. So if we can't use what we make, how do we get this essential nutrient? And guess what? Over 60% of vegetarians and even many meat eaters are deficient. This is stuff you need to know. There are only three reliable ways to get B12. One, animal products. Think liver and fish. They're like B12 bombs. But here's the catch. Milk and eggs, not so great. You'd need to drink four cups of milk or eat dozens of eggs a day to get enough. Not exactly practical. Two, fortified foods. This is B12 added to foods. Guess where most Americans get their B12? Breakfast cereal. A single bowl can cover your needs. Plant milks and nutritional yeast are also heroes here. Three, supplements. The easy button. A tiny pill once a day or even once a week can do the trick. Now for the secret nobody tells you. Your body can only absorb a little B12 at a time. That's why it's better to get a small amount multiple times a day, no matter your source. If you don't get enough, it's serious. B12 is crucial for your brain, blood, and energy. Deficiency can cause extreme fatigue and weakness, memory loss, numbness in your hands and feet. Your body can store B12 for years, so a deficiency can creep up on you silently. So what's the easiest plan? If you eat meat, make sure you're eating good sources like fish regularly. For everyone, consider a fortified cereal or plant milk, although these are considered processed foods which can be unhealthy. The super simple way, a supplement. You only need about 50 micrograms a day, or if you're lazy, a 2,000 microgram pill once a week should work fine. It costs pennies and it's a no-brainer for your health. B12 is non-negotiable. You have options, animal foods, fortified foods, or supplements. Don't gamble with your brain and energy. Share this with someone who needs to know. Follow for more tips to improve your personal health.